Hi and welcome to Standard 9. Standard 9 is about uh, um, areas, surface areas, and volumes of uh, complex forms. Let's take a look at it. Uh, Standard 9 says, students compute the volumes and surface areas of prisms, pyramids, and cylinders, cones, and spheres. The student commit to memory the formulas for prisms, pyramids, and cylinders. Now we'll look at this one here. 38, it says the four sides of the figure will be folded up and taped to make an open box. So if you look at this, if you were to take this and fold it right here, what you would get is a freestanding box. Um, the base would be the size of this square here, and the height would be the height that you get by folding this upwards. So the base is going to be 5 times 5, or 25, and the height will be this distance here, which is 2. So what we basically got is a box that looks like this. This is 2, this is 5, this is 5. So 5 times 5 is 25, times 2 is 50. 50 cm uh, cubed. 50 centimeters cubed will be the volume. So A is your answer. Okay, number 39. A classroom globe has a diameter of 18 inches. Okay, that tells us that this distance is 18 inches. So let's make sure to mark that correctly. Which of the following is the approximate surface area in square inches of the globe? Okay, so luckily it totally gives us the formula. So it's 4 pi times the radius squared. Now remember, this is not the radius. The radius, if the diameter is 18, the radius equals 9. So if r equals 9, then it's 4 pi times 9 squared. Now, 9 squared equals 81, so it's 4 pi times 81. So 4 times 81 is 324 times pi. And pi is 3.14. So what we've got is 324 times 314 for our answer. Um, and there's a decimal there. So 4 times 4 is 16, 4 times 2 is 9, uh, 4 times 3 is 12, 0, 4, 2, 3, 0, 0, 2, 7, 9. So 6, uh, 3, 1, 7, uh, 12. So what we've got here is... 1,017.4. It's really the only reasonable answer. Uh, my answer wasn't exactly the same, but it's the only answer that fits uh, what we've got here. So that's got to be the answer. Um, let's see. Number 40 is the last one we're going to do. Ooh, another, another fun pie problem. Vic is constructing a spherical. Okay, spherical, again, means a sphere. So that's a circular globe type thing. Model of Earth for a science fair project. His model has a radius of 24 inches. Radius. Okay. Since roughly 75% of Earth's surface is covered by water, he wanted to paint 75% blue to illustrate this fact. Approximately how many square inches of his model will be painted blue? Well, the first thing we've got to do is figure out the surface area. So the surface area is 4 pi times the radius squared. So 24 squared times 4 pi. So 24 squared is 576. So that times 4 is going to be 2,304. So then 2,304 times pi, 2,304 times 3.14. And this is going to be a big number. Um, going by the answers we have here, I think it's safe to estimate because these, these answers are not close to each other. So if we just estimate this, let's say it's 300 times 2,500, it's going to be, or 3 times 2,500, it's going to be about 7,500. Okay, when you see that, you're probably leaning towards answer B. But remember, we've got to do 75%. 75% is 3 fourths. So if we do 3 fourths of 7,500, 7, it's going to be smaller than 7,500. Uh, 3 times 7,500 is, if my calculations serve me correctly, 2,000 
or sorry, 22,500. And when you divide that by four, you're going to get 5,000 something. Um, the only answer that's even close to fitting this is A. Now you could do your math a lot more accurately, but considering, and this is a good thing to learn, considering the difference between these answers, you only need a ballpark answer because only one of these is going to be close. So it's something to think about. And that's it for standard nine. Thanks a lot.